We are a group of enthusiasts who believe in continuous improvement and innovation. To us, a problem is nothing but an opportunity to improve. I'm Ali Ronok, Project Marketing and Facilitator of Team Mohakash. Hi, I'm Bandita Basak Trisha, Data and Information Analyst of Team Mohakash. Hi, I'm Shishi Goyi, Content Creator and Graphical Expert of Team Mohakash. Hi, I am Samir Tias, the Account Web Developer, Team Mohakash. Hello, I am Mohamed Mominul Haq, Front End Web Developer of Team Mohakash. Hi, this is Kumi, I'm the Designer of Mars and also the Project Coordinator. Last year, we addressed the issue of the dead weight and longevity of the planetary geology toolset used by astronomers through our project called the Space Trident. This year, we have capitalized on the benefits of the Space Trident and have introduced an upgraded alternative to the large scoop to solve the crisis of regolith scattering in lunar gravity and its potential decaying tendencies of materials used by astronomers due to solar radiation ionization. We are calling it ARS, Advanced Regolith Sampler System. According to the Geology Tool Review report of the Apollo 11 to 17 mission, it is evident that the astronauts had severe difficulty while handling the regoliths. As they are ionized particles, due to the continuous absorption of solar radiation, the regoliths tend to stick to the spacesuits and other instruments. Thus, they are classified as potentially dangerous substances by scientists. Additionally, due to low gravity, while scooping, a significant portion of the regolith moves in an upward direction which makes the refill time twice from the anticipated time. These complex circumstances make it an opportunity for our Rs since regoliths are significant in various ways. Recently, advanced researchers have proven that the regoliths have almost 45% of oxygen chemically bonded with iron and titanium. Turning these regoliths into water is a significant invention in the step of colonization on the other planet. Hence, handling of regoliths is now a burning question to the engineers. Razer is an in-situ mining robot that is in its development stage to be used for mining a large number of regoliths for the oxygen generator reactor. However, Razer has a large capacity to serve massive scale operations rather than lower tasks. Our ARS makes this task more simplified for small scale and frequent excavations. It is a handheld tool that is attachable to an astronomer maneuver stem. It is very crucial to support both space expedition and colonization activities. Inspired by the development of the Razer project, we have considered the rotating regolith trapping bucket. Ars uses the battery-powered motor-driven set of bucket blades grouped sequentially to ensure the smooth scooping of the regolith from the planetary surface. The buckets have cutting teeth to facilitate regolith collection and a hinged gateway to control opening and closing. While rotating in the clockwise direction, the blades scoop up the regolith and trap it. When the astronaut reverses it counterclockwise, the material gets discharged. Finally, the previously built handlebar in the Space Trident toolset was updated to include three buttons near the T-collar, coupled to a wireless communication configuration to communicate with the Ars tool. By switching the buttons, astronauts may start cutting operations and specify the direction for material discharge. We think that our groundbreaking invention to replace the traditional large scoop equipment with our circular bucket system will result in superior regolith, collection and sample transport. It will also ensure lower exposure of regolith to astronaut spacesuits and equipment. Thus, our idea is well suited for the upcoming future expeditions that aim towards human colonization. To make our innovation a reality, all we need is the utmost support from NASA and its team. Your suggestions are extreme value to us. We believe our project can become the next big thing that makes planetary discoveries easier, safer and more convenient.